All right, and welcome back to our Phoenix Point playthrough. We're just gonna pick up right where we left off. <laughs> All right, hopefully today we can get our second squad up and running and a few other things. Everyone's looking tired, so they're gonna need a rest. Do I have the materials to recruit you? Ooh, yes we do, that would be perfect. Haven Info, recruit soldier, okay. Uh, R&D, there we go. I would say raid, but <laughs> our people would die if we wasted our energy on that right now. Everyone needs a little break. Let's see you. Let's get our personnel properly. Oh, nice. Sweet. I think I purchased you. Oh, look at that vibrant outfit you're wearing. <laughs> Let's see, you're going to need a pistol. Ammo and med kits. Med kits are always good. You're gonna need definitely a med kit and a grenade because you're gonna be a psychopath. I don't know what I'm gonna do with you yet. But you're gonna be awesome. Wait a minute. Let's see. No, no, he needs speed. All right. So you, base info, no. check this place. I can do recruits. Oh man, we have no food. I think that might be why I wasn't uh, rushing to do that. Everyone's gonna die. Starting this mission. <laughs> uh, hopefully there's food. That's priority number one. Once we get some food going, we'll be better off. <laughs> Resource management, my downfall. <laughs> the two with an armadillo, we can drive that around, drop off resources in there. Not ideal, but <laughs> it's what we got. lot right over here, so we're just going to park you in that direction. Spotted an enemy, perfect. Majority of the stuff is right here. Don't have anything over here. No, nothing near that. So let's try not to waste our ammo. And that's our farthest one. Okay.
let's see. If we do this, we get rid of the big guy. You guys are to focus. Gathering supplies. Operative on the move. High priority on that. I'm repositioning. All right, so let's get you over here. We did get some food supplies, that should keep us going for a little bit. We need to clear out the remaining of these areas without getting slaughtered by the enemies there. I'm here. Well, let's make this happen. shots do you have left of your weapon? No. It's too high of a risk. Insights. That hurt, didn't it? Let's have a look. Siphon you. Oh, I took it's out your arm too. too. I can make a difference. Let's get you up here. Uh, 
Oh, more food. Love it. Alright, so we're just gonna enter in here. I, there's no one there. Okay. Well, I whispered because I thought someone was there, but you were really intense. What's up? Boop. Just curious how it's going. I just started. It's only been going on for 12 minutes. Okay. <laughs> Freaking me out. points, but definitely got some ammo that we can use. Furs on that. My yes. know what's going on with that truck. <laughs> We're gonna kinda get everyone out. We got the main set of supplies. Ammo would have been nice, but oh eight out of twelve. Is there more somewhere? That thing has four? Oh that sucks. I'm gonna have to go and get that. No, it's not worth the will point loss and risk of life. Get your butt in, and we're getting out. Oh, there's one over here. Let's go and check that one. Animations are back up. Let's get out of here. Ten out of twelve, that's not too bad. 
last one's completely covered in chaos. Wow, my sniper gained two levels. God damn. <laughs> We do need to do some upgrading on our base here. <laughs> Got 200 food. Oh, yeah, that definitely stopped uh, starvation. Let's see, repair the fabrication facility. And we need a medical bay. will be very useful for your build later. Still don't know what else I want to mix you with yet. you more accurate or do I want you a chaos creature in the sky? Yeah, we'll do that. Oh uh, definitely war cry. Definitely war cry. Always the war cry. We will be giving you that, but we gotta get armor to upgrade it first, so it's not worth it right now. You are returning fire. Don't know what I want to mix you with. Okay. Research, so we're gonna need that done, that done. That done. Perfect. We got a lot of stuff going, but we'll get there. You I need exploring things. We also need to do that. So undefendable ends in four days. Let's go and explore here. See how things are going. The Helios 2 has landed outside a wealthy estate. The whole place looks abandoned, is completely overgrown. The security fence has been smashed down by a truck. Our offer to struggle through the undergrowth until they find a huge rusted model of the solar system. An orrery. Built right here in someone's garden, our operatives take several pictures for study. The planets and moons are to scale, and there seems to be several unidentified objects in this model. According to whoever built this, there are at least 12 planets in our solar system with several objects on huge orbits far beyond Pluto and Neptune. The estate has been looted, but it looks like looters were mainly after food. There are still a few things we could take. Good. That's always good. Plunder them. Plunder them wholeheartedly. Let us go and make contact with this group. Research complete. Nice. Pandora and evolution done being researched. Let's go there. Longinus Point is well armed and extremely isolated. Haven that rarely deals with the outside world. Its leader, Justinian Sinemold, was a, once a prominent member of New Jericho, split with Tobias West over the latter's obsession with genetic purity, taking much of Van. Venadium's old Advanced Genetics Warfare Division with him. The split led to an extremely bloody two-day battle in June of 2043, and they have remained sworn enemies since. Uh, after we broke with West, he explains, we named our new organization Alchemy because we intended to have all kind of flexibility. West is incapable of, but it seems we are lacking the right alchemist. The alchemist in question is a genetist now working for the Disciples of Anu. Wants this individual to retrieve and is willing to pay for our services. Oh, I didn't mean to cause that. <laughs> Damn. I'm friendly with them, at least. Still friendly with everyone. <laughs> this is complete. Ooh, trade protocols. Yes. 
Now we can start trading with these people. Get some more stuff going. Yeah, we're gonna need to go there before it gets too bad. So why don't we move you on over? Oh, nice. Let's see. They want four for six. So if we were to do this, we would give up 228 for 342. We'll do that for now, because I need that. Even info. We don't have the food for it. Of course we don't have the food for it. Well, let's send you over here for that. Let's send you back over here. I'd rather explore that right now. Start the mission here. Is everyone ready for chaos? Yeah. That is a very freaky hand that's on his face. I mean, I'm just gonna refuse to acknowledge the Cthulhu-ness behind it, but... The handprint itself is freaky. Alright. Let's see. We're here. And we got research points. One looks like two right in there and two over there. So we're not going to be able to reach there right now. Let's move gentle. Target located. Oh, where's the sniper? Oh, of course. Get out of the sniper's range. I'm oh, there's move. another one. Hot diggity damn. You Jericho, you're just not making this easy for me. You know that, right? Move quickly and violently forward. No back. They can still use their pistols. Oh, would you look at that? You have a shot. Acquiring target. Will you hit? Wouldn't connect the Probably shot. not. Targeting. Target missed. Just suppressing. Okay, so let's see. If I dash with you in here. Enemy in visual. And then dash with you I can here. Do it. I can get you. I'll try here. to get there in one piece. Yes, please. Yes, please. And let's see. Yes. Just what I wanted. Uh, stealing research. Always, always best just to be quick. even by an enemy, even if they are cowards and traitors. The research we obtained is more than a set of upgrades. It is the first step in reclaiming the planet. Humanity will be born again, and this time, the cure will show the path. Yeah, and I'm gonna have to kill y'all. So, you know, it's a bittersweet victory for me. Research complete. 
New Jericho was one man's vision, and everything depended on that one man. Before the war, Tobias West had been a billionaire, an elusive, controversial businessman who denounced war even as he profited from it. So an iron the world fell, his empire began to rise. Some said he was a genius, a man of principle, dedicated to equality and merit, fighting to preserve the core of human freedom, our will. They said he had a plan, that he could lead us to victory. Others called them a dictator, a megalomaniac, fearful of infection and obsessed with purity. They said he was willing to do anything to win, no matter the cost. The Phoenix Project needed allies. New Jericho could help us turn the tide, but it all depended on one man. Yeah, but that man does have a pretty awesome trench coat, I'm just saying. It, it, it might be worth it just for the trench coats. Shotgun tech! Let's raid our leader's house! Hmm, you know, just imagine that thing crawling through your window at night. Nightmare fuel. Nightmare fuel. Half these creatures' designs are just nightmare fuel if you picture them coming into your house. Ready. Huh? Ready to engage. Can you actually hit it? Finger on the trigger. Oh, how sweet you could. Eyes you can too. You have a better shot. <laughs> One crab cake, mate. Ready. I need you, sir. Up here. Hmm. You will send me here. Here I come. I'm repositioning. Come now. We know there's more here. You can just chill. Oh, there's another one. Let's make this happen. Well, we are. You just gotta be patient. We can't seem to find anyone to kill for you. How rude of them, right? Show them what we can do. There we go. Oh, uh, another enemy. Wow, they like to be over there. I'll be right there. Kill. If I'm correct, it should be right here. To coordinates. Yep. Moving in. Now we just gotta find the rest of the enemies and slaughter them all and make some crab cakes. Here I am. Let's do this. Rolling out. I feel like everyone's down in the front yard. That was rude. Targeting. 
Nice. <laughs> Acquiring targets. There we go. Everyone's happier when you're dead. Now, why don't you want to make people happy, little dragon? You're gonna get demoted for this, man. You gotta hit the target. You gotta hit. Just a bit off. I feel insulted for you, sir. Pushing on. <laughs> No rest for the wicked. Oh, wait, can you actually Duncan. see it? Shoot. Yeah, I feel insulted for you, sir. <laughs> On Overwatch, let them come. Do you see anything here up here? Here comes the Phoenix. Well, dang. Let's go down here, see if there's anything in the second floor. Nada? Here not a comes thing? the Phoenix. Okay. Here I come. Send you to your death, possibly. Moving now. Let's do this. Hmm. I'll be right there. Rolling out. Hmm. Where in the seven hells can this last enemy be? Running. Let's make this happen. Let's go. Ah, aha. Let's do this. Please tell me you are not underground. All right, there we go. jump through windows from the second floor like it's nothing. It's perfectly fine. Nice shot, man. That that was actually a really good shot from that distance with that weapon. Weapon. Blah, blah, blah. Weapon. Here you go. I've got this. No level ding dings, that's sad. That is true, it is a fast way to progress your research. It's also theft and pisses people off. I'd rather keep them happy so I can steal their planes. As the world fell apart around us, it was difficult not to feel guilty. Some chose to be proactive and fight, but not me. I came here instead. My best weapon is my mind, and I need silence to put it to work. The history of the Phoenix Project is a complex tapestry. In Russia, Turkey, Britain, Spain, not one unbroken lineage, but a tangle of organizations, each passing the torch to the next with only one goal, to protect the human race. But protect it from what? Did they know about the Pandora virus, and if so, how? The answers are out there. So much has been investigated and collected and analyzed, but it's all scattered, lost. I don't know if it's possible to track it all down, but I have to try. 
There's only one thing I'm sure of. I can't stay here anymore. Yes, because that would make everything too easy. Operatives have retrieved a big batch of documents from Symes' retreat. These should allow us to better understand what Symes was doing and what he discovered. Hmm. Side and five, three key sites that Symes singled out as particularly relevant to his research into the history of the Phoenix Project and previous outbreaks of unusual diseases. It is imperative that we send operatives to investigate these sites as soon as the strategic situation allows. Blah, 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 blah. Language. Got so many places. Let's see. Prisoner of Ice is in America. Frozen in Russia. Rise by Sun of Virtue right there. Oh! Phoenix, too. You can hit two of those pretty well. Helios, explore that place. Let's see you. We need to keep up with the explorations. Here, please. Oh, nice. Continue on your way there. New Jericho. While exploring a seemingly unremarkable ruin, our operatives stumble across a book half hidden in a pile of rubble, an old copy of Olaf Stapledon's visionary novel, Star Maker. It is unusually well preserved. Further investigation reveals that what appears to be a collapsed library sealed off under the rubble. The books have remained almost completely undamaged. While not useful in our war against the Pandora virus, these books represent a vital part of humanity's history. Would digging them out be worth it? Uh... Yeah. It would give me two people to like me. Digging out the books takes a surprisingly long time, but the bounty is rich, including the complete work of Doris Lessing, Robert Byron's The Road to Vak... Oxiana and the worn copy of Arkady and Boris Strugatsky, The Final Circle of Paradise. Long thought lost. Okay. Well, I'm glad we found a library. I mean, makes the world a better place, right? A Sinedrian Haven is under attack. Manticore 1. This is a transmission to the world. We are the pure, and our time hiding in the shadows is over! Squads of our chosen warriors are already combing the world in search of resources and technology that will help us defeat the Pandoran threat. A word of warning, don't get in our way. We will show no mercy, we will allow no bargaining. We are the pure! And at this point, it's where you realize... Crap. <laughs> Research complete. Ooh, shotguns. What's our next one? How long is that going to take? Research rabs are still being built 7-7, seven, seven, so... Construction complete. Got some brutes. And a gunner. And a thug. Wonderful. Y'all should make that. We want to endear ourselves to Sinadrin. We're we'll getting an abandoned mining camp. The miners appear to have been killed not by Pandorans, but by entirely human security forces, most likely during one of the major strikes that occurred in the course of World War III. A number of banners detailing the miners' demands are still fluttering in the breeze, the writing bleached by the sun. Our optics have recovered all the resources they could find. It looks like after the miners were killed, no one ever came back here. A typically meaningless tragedy of the kind human history is full of. Make some shotguns. Those are always good to have. Make two of those. Let's see. Need to activate a base over here, so Central America. Let's repair that. Need to repair that. Start getting people over here to do that, and steal a vehicle for it. And you. Construction complete.
Hmm. So Adrian already got infiltrators out. Nice. Uh, you. Can't wait. Grab him before he kills himself. Already there. Reporting enemy. Here they are. Good. They're all over there, huh? So you're gonna stay there for right now. Well, damn. Using. Repositioning. To position y'all like the wind. I can't do anything right now. Moving in quick. There's another one. <sighs> you dirty stinking biatch. Is just inconvenient. Let's rock. Very disappointed in that mess. Enemy hit. Yeah. Be right there. One down and two disarmed. Targeting enemy. Two down. Oh, of course, it has some poison stuff. Now it's dead. Oh! Thank you. 
firing target. Ready to engage. That's even better. Okay, let's see. There would be another place to go. Right here. Research complete. Perfect. Finish that. Next researching will be done in two hours. Operatives in Helios 2 have discovered what looks like an abandoned town, but it actually isn't a town at all. The roads are all too perfect. The house is too empty. According to archives, this tests for automated vehicles. Research complete. Total human population gathered in the safety of havens can now be tracked on a daily basis. We have also calculated survival threshold for human reproduction. Once the Pandoran threat is eliminated, the population falls below this threshold, then humanity will not survive in the long term. It is imperative that we do not let this happen. Ugh. Nice. Thank you for that. Father of the Reform, Joseph Saxon, better known as the Father of the Reform, was once a high ranking member of the Disciples of Anu, taking orders directly from the Synod of Yearning. But then something happened. Some say he heard a whisper, something the Exalted said to the Taxiarch Nurgle. That no one else was supposed to hear. On that day, Saxon rejected the Exalted and proclaimed himself the true Messiah. He and his followers, who called themselves the Reformed, founded Khan de Girak as the center of a new, more truthful religion that would lead people to the dead god. Since then, it has grown but slowly. It's a strange, hostile place, and few disciples are willing to abandon their faith in the Exalted. Those who do follow Saxon, however, would follow him into hell. Uh, I'm gonna warn the disciples. Thank you. Let's see. They're 4%, 9%, 14 Oh, gosh. This one has landed in less than a kilometer away from a huge fire. It looks like an entire abandoned village is burning. A few buildings at the edge of the blade could still be searched, although it's risky. Uh, my soldiers got hurt. Ugh. Yeah, they're fine for now. We, they can do some more exploration. Our op discovered a new Jericho listening post used to spy on Sanadrin and the Disciples of Anu. The facility is fully automated. Mm, let's covertly. I don't want to take a hit from New Jericho at this point. Research complete. Underground tunnels? Okay, good some of that. Let's go to our base. Uh... Yes. Irony is R&D has nothing to do with R&D, but let's get a... Do I not have living corners here? Oh, that's going to need to be fixed. plants are up and running. Inside project. Heard a lot about you people. Most of it weird. Science nerds with guns, huh? 
Well, I've heard worse ideas. Anyway, here's the inside scoop on New Jericho. Tobias West? Probably a genius. Might be a bit crazy, but he has a plan. And a real plan is a heck of a lot better than all that touchy-feely crap at Sinedrian or whatever the hell those squid-worshipping disciples are up to. So stick with us, and maybe we'll die, or maybe we'll win. But either way, it'll be fun. Fort Terminus and Nurse alerts us, our operatives, to the presence of Colonel Budahas, whose investigation in the Secret Service government we have funded. He's in the infirmary, dehydrated and delirious. He clutches a black bulletproof briefcase and refuses to give anyone except his Phoenix Project operative. You don't know what I had to do to get my hands on this, he says. It's so body shaking. The things I've seen, my mind, I'll never be the same again. But it's here. It's right here. The truth. You just have to open it. Briefcase contains documents that prove conclusively that the CIA, a pre-war intelligence organization, had a division dedicated not only to investigating unusual phenomenon, but to actively sabotaging the Phoenix Project. The files compiled by an individual known only as Operative 11 show that General Newton Sumrall was deliberately undermined by his group. The briefcase also contains the true results of Phoenix Project studies that were deliberately distorted by a double agent. Those jerks. Ooh, capture and containment. Oh yeah. Let's see, we'll go down here. Nothing there, let's see. Uh might have some up. complete. No. Construction complete. Oh, not enough. Okay. Keep our exploration. Research complete. Mindfragger egg. Aw, that was destroyed. Research complete. Good. Increased damage on that. Our operatives have set down outside an abandoned factory. There's a lot of old wrecked machinery here. Perhaps we can use some of that. Land of an unmarked and abandoned research base. It looks like this location was established in the last decade or so. Security fences are wrecked and the living areas have been picked clean, but there is a laboratory that appears to have been left alone. Uh, in addition to the regular equipment, one might expect in the lab, there is an extremely large nitrogen freezer containing a complete Arthron, its head neatly cut open. The brain has been removed and hooked up to a makeshift device that resembles the offspring of a microwave oven in a satellite dish. <laughs> it looks damaged. Let's repair it. All right, our operatives have fixed the device. Probably, probably, it's still not entirely clear what it does. Whoever built it was either a genius or a lunatic, possibly both. <laughs> uh, ooh, shield technology! Yeah. No, I don't want to trade you. I want. I can't even get your soldier there. I need to find a freaking. Nice. The disciples of Anu were a mystery. Where others saw devastation, they saw hope. Where others saw the end of the world, they saw a new beginning. Their leader called herself the Exalted, and she claimed to believe in humanity. She preached that the human soul was perfect, that the root of our problems was our insufficient evolution. The Pandora virus was a threat, but it was also an opportunity to change ourselves, to become better humans, to mutate. We knew that humanity needed to adapt. There was no other way to survive. The disciples offered a solution, but what was their end game? There was something beyond their hierarchies and their rituals. The exalted had a secret. Okay, so let's see. We got plenty of food. Can you trade anything? No, we got a research center. Uh, you're looking for tech. 
nothing I need over there. So nothing I really need, but we're going to start visiting places. I'd like to get y'all some more units, though. You guys, on the other hand, over here. Let's see. Materials. Oh. Oh, no. No. Hmm. So 30 for 135? Mm. Yeah, I'll we'll take it for now. Research complete. Good. Blast resistant technology, improved med kits, person journey with demo. Wow. Uh -huh. Catching up. Gotta love those research plants. Wait. Wow. That was convenient. <laughs> Let's see, we need to edit you up. Uh, yes, please. And yes, please. Let's get you some more will points. You. We need you to move faster. So you can take some of that. Try to kill something this time. was on the roof. You covered. No, too far away still. There we go. That's a good parking spot. Someone down there. Let my action see the enemy. <laughs> I can't wait to upgrade you with a better chess piece. Ooh. Yeah. Sir. Oh man, there's a lot more of them around than I was anticipating. Well, you're dead. <laughs> Uh, 
Oh, yeah, that's right. They can have return fire. Didn't do anything though, but that's fine. Might have killed you, cost you your life, but you at least took it out. shot on anyone else besides that guy. Okay, so if you go here, you can. On it. Death by hammer. Come on. Amy. Yeah. <laughs> Headshot. My Zerk's up to levels. Da 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 da. Mm. Good. And how's our diplomacy looking? Disciples are at 10, 15, and 14. Facilities down. Let's go over here. for this group over here. Does anyone have one in this area? Nope, I'm not, I can see. Well, let's keep exploring. We got more mist popping up. You fast, Emma. Hmm. Don't really have equipment. Oh crap! I gotta go pick her up then. That was a mistake. All right. You guys go to Phoenix Point. Pick up your new recruit. Yeah, you continue what you're doing. Oh, 
Whoops. You go to your job. Research complete. Good. What's our next one? Basic bionic will be done in a day and eleven hours. Lots of some Bantan. There's a huge shopping complex here built out of concrete and glass. The doors have been smashed, but most of the shops and goods are intact. Yay, let's search them all. Oh, good, 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 good. Go here. Uh, personnel. There's someone on this base. We get in there. Thank you. We do that. Helios 2. We have one person that has no equipment on. And a shotgun. You're looking badass. You guys go start researching over there. Form the shield bear, wonderful. And a ghoul. Hooray! Explore! Over here. Oh, nice. That one. Construction complete. You know what? Let's do some of these missions. The stone above bandage are set down near an old church. The graves have been disturbed. It's almost as if someone dug up all the bodies, or they came alive and ripped their way out of the ground. But that doesn't happen, does it? I mean, we're dealing with a mutating virus. Anything's possible at this point. Further investigation turns out the bodies were dug up as part of some forgotten experiment. One of the houses in the village has been converted into a lab and is full of human body parts fitted with cybernetic enhancements preserved in some kind of embalming fluid. At least we know the Pandora virus hasn't started animating the dead yet. Uh, you know what? Why don't y'all go and take care of that mess, see if we can't start becoming better friends with people. In his essays, my great-grandfather recounts the story of the ill-fated Chinling Bashan expedition of 1915 and the journal of Lei Meng, the leader of the mission, who found evidence of a forgotten proto-civilization deep below the ground. There is also mention of James Dawson, a British photographer who stole most of the precious samples recovered by the team. What became of Dawson has always been a mystery, but now I know the mundane truth. He died here in the mountains, forgotten and alone. This proto-civilization, could it hold the key to defeating the Pandora virus? They say history repeats itself. Has all of this happened before? We shall learn. The coordinates and science notes have led our captives to a small abandoned camp high up in the mountains. Behind it lies the entrance to a cave. The cave contains the corpse of a Caucasian male. It is hard to identify at first as it is overgrown with yellow, sickly looking leaves sprouting from the shriveled skin. A backpack on the floor contains faded photographs and broken specimen jars. Sime seems to have taken what he needed, but even what remains is enough to revolutionize our understanding of this planet's biological history. Our analysis of the leaves growing from the body show that this organism contains traces of the Pandora virus, but a different, older strain. The implications of this discovery warrant further study. Good. So that's one thing down. For action! Yes! Your speed is already maxed, sir. Then we are going to have fun with you. Let's see.
going to make a stealthy heavy. I might just do that. I don't think I've ever done that before. That's going to be an interesting concept for me. Boom blast isn't necessary, but... Yes. Power. You good, sir? You good, sir, are gonna be fun to play with once I get you ready. Mm. <laughs> Another fun combo. Perfect. Everyone set up. Deploy! So let's see, right off the bat we have one of those over there, and we have nothing, no idea what's over here, so... Yeah, you're not gonna get a shot, man. Target hit. Here. Ready to fire. Here. Over there, so comes online. Be right there. Do a dirty check. No. What? <laughs> no. What's our move? Preparing to fire. A little disappointed in that. Moving out. Oh, snap, son. Run back. A little too close for comfort there. Moving now. Targeting. There we go.
Right there. There we go. All better now. Arm. Let up find this last hatching sentinel. Let's do this. Moving now. Repositioning. I'm on the move. Be over here. Stay with your group. Survival is in number. Prioritizing speed. Running. way, which would lead up into this mess, or I can go this way, which would lead over here. merged together, which means it's somewhere in this corner over here, probably. Making haste! our move. Destroy it! <laughs> Got some levels!
Sinidrian probably seems strange to you. Trying to build a better world. A world radically different from the one most of us grew up in. Well, I'm sure it sounds very utopian. But why do we so easily accept the world getting worse and can never imagine it getting better? The world can definitely I'm get I'm glad our values are aligned, at least in this matter. Please keep thinking about what kind of world you want to live in. Maybe we can build it together. Am um, I looking? 19, 20, and 14. Uh, still got a lot of work to do on that. You guys need to take a little break. Research complete. Woohoo! Let's see. Biogen augmentation. Adrian will bring benefits to both of us. The Malthusian faction never belonging with those deluded, deluded idealists anyway. Like the Phoenix Project, they cannot understand the true horrors, the horrors of the world because they've never seen it. The misguided dreams they surround themselves with are dangerous, leading humanity to a dead end. For the sake of the future, they must be exterminated. Exterminated! Again and again and again. You, though, have shown us that you have what it takes to begin anew. It's almost impressive how well Synadrion scientists have adapted New Jericho's technology. In a few months, they've achieved more than West could in decades. And still those that lead them suffer the same fallacy as he did. As he did, they are not prepared for total conversion, abandoning flesh to embrace the machine. You have 24 hours to remove your conspirators from the research area. When we attack, all will be gunned down. Gunned down! After that, the second renaissance will begin. Beginning and end. Alpha and Omega. Ugh. You have your chance to break from Sanadrion, and Tobias West and the other cowards will be purged away. Just don't try to cross us, Mikhail. If this turns out to be a trap, trap, we'll still get the technology. And the Malthusians will be added to the extinction list. Oh, good. Team One can handle that. Wonderful. Why do I keep coming back here? Ilyusto has landed on an abandoned military base. This site is not on the old maps and databases. It looks like it was used to train and develop some sort of special operations unit dedicated to fighting the invaders. There's a lot of equipment here we can use. Good. Whew. That was a good haul. Good, good, good haul. Take this one out. Yeah, might as well. I need Jericho to handle this under attack. Let's just make sure everyone has equipment. That's all the extra ammo I got for you, man. I don't know why everyone's coming in purple today. <laughs> all right.
Haven defense minion, uh, civilians, oh joy. Going in. Operative on the move. Where's their extraction point? Oh, all the way over there? Yeah. You're just gonna go in here. Same with you. If you're all in one place, it's easier to have someone protect you. Well, let's make this happen. Oh, yeah. Operative on the move. Target located. Got one right there. We've got incoming. Let's blast him. <laughs> Proceeding. Relocate. Shot there, man. You're gonna love this. Now that was a good shot. And it's a stupid one. Oh, there's a Triton over there. Ugh. So we got three on that side, two charging towards us, or the civilians need to deal with that. take out that guy's shield someone else could deal with him that would be wonderful this place stinks not gonna work okay easy enough insides Nice shot. He must not have a spitter head. We 
since taking out his pincer was doubly the best idea to do. Poor soul. This is going to make all the difference. No, it is not, because you're not going to hit where you're at right now. Yeah, you aren't going to hit that. That was just a waste of ammo. in full retreat, but should just leave these two tritons. How much health does this have? It is 10, it's gonna reach in 10, it's got 10. Oh, you are annoying. <laughs> That was perfect. 
That was perfect. <laughs> people up to trust me enough to give me their haven so I don't have to waste time exploring all of them. Ugh. Come on. Don't don't crap out on me. having issues. Moving forward now? Do we get past whatever the frack that was? Kind of. There we go. Whew, that was weird. Good to be working with you. If we're going to save the world, we'll need all the help we can get. At this stage, we've granted you low-level access to our network and set up a liaison office to work with your people. But, as I'm sure you can understand, we need to take things slow at first. Your organization has a reputation. It's hard to know which side you'll take, and we need to know that you share our values. At the moment, we're setting up a mission to recapture an old satellite control base. What for? Well, there's a saying in New Jericho, Tobias West always has a plan. And he has a plan for the equipment and the data we can get from that base. You'll find out more when the time is right. So, are you up for it? We'd really appreciate your help. Phase one over there. Oh, that's not too bad. Let's see. And we should have enough. Have you actually now? Of course not. No. So we can go with another sniper. But that's the only person we got at phase 124. Yeah, no one else is close. Yeah, let's get a new sniper. Specialized Pandoran containment facilities have been designed and successfully tested, allowing us to safely keep Pandorans in a state of constant paralysis. This represents a step forward in our struggle to understand their biology. Yay! Mm. Yes, combat shields. Yeah, I know, materials are getting low. Well, 
We'll work on that in a bit. Y'all are going to need a break after this. Hmm. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. Keep going. Keep moving. I know. Something else is downloaded somewhere on this computer. Hunker down, find the enemy, kill them. happen. <laughs> they can't stop me. Actually, I'm pretty sure they can, but let's not ruin that enthusiasm. Go. You go with our, our, our Zerk friend. He's dead. We don't need to worry about him. Everyone's already in this building. Uh, ah! Hey, the 
first things first, heal yourself. Second things first, get into cover. Ready. Got you. What are you Success until it's dead. Taking point. Nothing's getting past me. Just like target practice. That's unlucky. Yes, just like target practice. for 20, you only have 10 health, yet you're not going to be a threat. Goodbye! On Overwatch, let them come. On the move! Nothing will get past me. Rolling out! Uh, perfect trap. <laughs> yeah, that sniper deserved his level. And that should give us all of New Jericho's, ha New Jericho's Havens. Language and English is hard. <laughs> Uh, supportive of the Phoenix Project, the location of New Jericho's Havens have been added to the Geoscape. Defend them to earn reputation. Failure to defend them under attack will lose some report. I just wanted to pass on my personal thanks and congratulations to your operatives for their work at the base. Fortuna eruditis favit, as they say. Fortune favors the prepared mind. The intelligence we've retrieved is going to prove extremely helpful with all the projects we're working on. And the satellite control tech may one day help turn the tide of this war. This operation may have seemed like a small thing, but the devil's in the details. And so is God. Okay. Speaking of details, we'll now have to actually make all of this work with our hardware and software. We have limited resources, so we need our brightest and best focused on the job. It'll take time, but it'll be worth it in the end. You'll see. I look forward to it. Alright, you guys go and rest. Construction complete. Research complete. Blast resistant tech, good. Y'all just rest for now. Let's see. Oh wait. 
bases, bases, that's what I need. Seven is the one that has the cybernetics going into it. Does it have satellite coupling? Good. How's that looking over there? Definitely need to get our hands on a vehicle for them at some point. Might be time to hit up a new Jericho base. Biochemist, ready for action. Yes, please. No, you do not get the shield. And once we finish this base mission, we are going to call it a night for the night. Um, if you uh, want to keep up, feel free to follow. Uh, our next stream for this will most likely be Sunday night at 8 p.m. And we'll be going for about four hours from there, so that'll be about 8 to midnight. is no longer a threat at all, at least for now. Now it's truly no threat. Sniper's gonna need to be bailed out.
This better work. Here I come. Attacking this man. <laughs> Do we have a plan for. Let me down. And mission's done. <laughs> so, as I did said earlier, this is our last mission for the night. I do hope you all enjoyed the stream, and I hope you'll join me again on Sunday. <laughs>